Shameless is Fiona Gallagher. That's who. Uh, Fiona left the show after the first two series, but the Wild Child recently returned for one last jaunt around the Chatsworth estate. Well, she's here now, and welcome. It's lovely to have you lovely. on our final show. Yeah, I love it. Guests to have. What were the circumstances of you saying yes to that, to going back? To the final mm. episode. Well, uh, I'd kind of made a drunken agreement. When I left, I'd had a couple of glasses of wine, and they'd said, oh, I'll come back and do the last one. And I thought, yes, of course I will. <laughs> Either it'll never happen, mm. or it'll be next year or something. Or they'll forget. Or... Yeah. And then many, many, many years go by. And uh, I got a phone call, and I don't know whether it was to do with that night or just a coincidence, but they asked me to come back for that. Well, Clooney did it, didn't he? Exactly, and if George Clooney can do it... Not in Shameless, of course, no. he did it in <laughs> ER. <laughs> it would have liked it. Yeah. <laughs> the final <laughs> episode. Um, what was it like going back? Was it almost like going back to your old school? Had things changed? It was really lovely, actually. I, I, I can't lie, I felt incredibly... Um, I felt really nostalgic in yeah. all the right ways. Yeah. Um, the set had hardly changed. And there were loads of props that were there from the very first series mm. scattered around and pictures of all of us from that time and well, You know shameless changed my life professionally and personally so I know. I, I, I'm extraordinarily fond of it. Well you met your husband there. Yeah, so that's one thing that you managed to get yeah, out of the series well, you know, <laughs> and, uh, and the work that I mean lots of us have had since mm. has changed things for lots of us. Also lovely I would have thought on that last one because David Threlfall, David who of course is Frank, yeah. um, was directing. Yeah. So that's the whole team back together yeah. again. Yeah, so it was. It was my experience of it was generally the people I'd known from the beginning. Yeah. And it had kind of become another program since we'd all left. There were different families, people yeah. we didn't know. So for then, for me to go back and just be in that world, the Gallagher world, mm. was nice. It was just extraordinary. Well, it's it's very a far world from where you are at the moment. You know, you're only down the road at the National yeah. Theatre, and this um, is a play called Strange Interlude, yeah. and this follows the story of Nina and her various men throughout her life but you say it's kind of got that feel of a of an old black and white movie in a way it is it's like an old Joan Crawford or a Bette Davis movie it's fabulous actually and it it's ba it goes from the 20s up to the sort of mid 40s and so you you travel with her from her being very young and and well, she's heartbroken at she's first. Heartbroken she's heartbroken at the beginning. She's, she's lost. I don't want to spoil anything, so, no, but, but that's okay to say that, to isn't say. it? So, yeah. She so she's she's lost love. her first yeah. love in the war in the first and war. is absolutely heartbroken, yeah. but then becomes really, for her, quite reckless. She does. I think, I mean, it's funny. When the play was written, it would have seemed to be, you know, it seemed very shocking, but of course now we're so used to saying what happens to people when their boundaries become a bit sort of perforated and they're looking for answers in other people and. You know, it's quite sort of for us, it's like, yeah, people do that stuff. We know that stuff. We mm. recognise that. But then it would have been very shocking. But mm. but then she ends up marrying somebody because she's encouraged to marry them for her sanity. Mm. Mm. And, of course, it's not for love. So she looks for that outside of the relationship. And you can imagine. So it's, it's quite sexy on. and, you know. When, um, when it was originally written, the first time it, it was performed was about sort of 1928. Mm. And... At uh, that time, it was a five-hour <laughs> long five play. Hours. I mean, it's nowhere near as long as that now. No, but, but I hasten to add, it's yeah. just over three hours. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. So at that well, there time, there was a dinner break in the yeah. middle, wasn't there? People we would go to. home, dress for dinner. dinner. You go home. You go home and dress for dinner, or go to a restaurant. You'd dress for dinner, go out and eat, then come back to the theatre to see the rest of the play. That's a proper night out. It's isn't quite it? good fun, though, isn't it? it? Might be quite good love, but of course, then everyone would have had a couple of glasses of wine, and so they needed to do a lot of recapping. Ah. <laughs> so the play became extraordinarily. So I guess you just cut out all the recapping stuff and a then wee you... bit, and there were a few other. You know, it's quite a lot of trimming we could do without doing yeah. any damage. But you, um, you are on stage most of the time. This is yeah, a yeah, big yeah. role for you, yeah. isn't it? 
uh, obviously not something that you would uh, you'd be concerned about I'm assuming do you worry about things like that well that's what you want you know six months time I'll probably you know I'm a lucky girl to get to do this if you get to do what you love and you get to do lots of it you can't grumble can you it doesn't matter if you're a bit tired <laughs> you've had, um, I mean, it's, you've had rave reviews for it so far. All well, the critics have been brilliant. But you, you don't really pay too much attention to that, do you? No, you can't. Because it's, you know, it's that classic thing. If you went to a party and ten people said you look fabulous, one person went, a bit tired. That's all you think <laughs> yeah. about, isn't it? So you're best to avoid it, really. Best Were you, um, it's, your, your choices of work or, or the things you choose or not choose to do is quite interesting because you very nearly turned this down. And you very nearly turned Shameless down as well, didn't you? Well, uh, for the play, it was, I just had my baby. And I received this huge play, and I thought, oh, I don't know how I could get my head around that. Yeah. Not thinking that it would be a few years down the line they were programming it for. With Shameless, I nearly didn't go to the audition. Um, because I thought, oh, she's 21, I'm 31. I'm not from Manchester. I'm not, oh, why will I get on the train and go up there and, you know, waste everybody's time? And then it just... I had it wrong. Well, thank God you had it really, really wrong yeah. because you would—you would never have met James. You never yeah. had a, that start in in your career like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Life could have been very different. Yeah. It's those sliding doors, isn't it? Isn't it? Yeah. 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 And sometimes it's just—you just got to try things, haven't you? And not find reasons not to. Well, you—you've uh, done a couple of films as well. Yeah. Um, you've uh, been shooting in London, which is nice because because you're, you're your mum, so that's lovely to be able to work your family. locally. Yeah. Yeah. I, I would suppose. Uh, Close Circuit—that's uh, a thriller. Sounds fantastic. Terrorism and the it law. Is, right it up is. It is a street. brilliant script, I have to say. And uh, and then also before I go to sleep, that's the adaptation of the novel. That's with Nicole Kidman, who yeah. you say is also nice and normal and just a working mum. Yeah, that's what we talked about actually. How tired we were, the logistics of being working mums, how much you miss your kids. I mean, after that, you guys, what it's like to be a working parent. You know, so mm. yeah, and we did have a good giggle. So, well, there uh, that's all coming up. Um, what's James doing now? Is he busy? He is in uh, Canada filming another X Men movie. Oh, is he? <laughs> yes, he is. So, he's doing lots of this across the, <laughs> across the ocean. Yeah, so, uh, yeah. Uh, the uh, s uh, film, uh, the movie, uh, no, 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 hey. movie, the movies are out <laughs> later so in much. the year. The movies up. are out later in the year. The play is at the National just down the yeah. road and, and the it's a strange interlude. No, yeah. till the 1st of September. 1st oh, of September? Extended. Yeah, we're on till the 1st of September. Oh, really? Oh, good. Oh, good job you yeah, said that. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's getting extended in front of our very eyes. I know, it has. Marvellous, must be good. Thank you very much. Lovely to see you. Right, time for an important announcement.